The book of Genesis, chapter 22, verses 20 through 24 reads, Some time later Abraham was told, Milcah is also a mother, she has borne sons to your brother Nahor, Uz the firstborn, Buzz his brother, Kemuel, the father of Aram, Kest, Hazel, Pildash, Jedloth, and Betuel. Betuel became the father of Rebekah. Milcah bore these eight sons to Abraham's brother Nahor. His concubine, whose name was Ruma, also had sons, Teba, Gam, Tehash, and Maka. This passage introduces us to the descendants of Nahor, Abraham's brother. It highlights the growth and expansion of Nahor's family, emphasizing the importance of lineage and heritage in biblical times. In this passage, we see the fulfillment of God's promise to Abraham's family. Nahor's lineage is blessed with many descendants, showcasing God's faithfulness in multiplying their numbers. This reminds us that God's promises are steadfast and true, and He is always faithful to fulfill them in His perfect timing. The mention of Rebekah in this passage is significant. Rebekah would later become the wife of Isaac, Abraham's son, and play a crucial role in the continuation of God's covenant with Abraham's descendants. This highlights the interconnectedness of God's plan and how each individual plays a part in His divine purpose. This passage also teaches us about the importance of family and heritage. Just as Nahor's descendants were blessed and multiplied, we too can find strength and identity in our own families and heritage. It encourages us to value and cherish our loved ones, recognizing the blessings that come from our familial connections. In conclusion, Genesis 22, 20-24 reminds us of God's faithfulness, the significance of each individual's role in this plan, and the importance of family and heritage. Let us hold on to these truths and apply them to our lives, trusting in God's promises, valuing our loved ones, and recognizing our unique roles in His divine purpose. Amen.